So we are Team Workbench and we are working with uh, Amazon's Lumberyard Game Engine. Uh, our aim this semester is to be able to explore Lumberyard, taking forward last semester's project, uh, Sawmill, and exploring the capabilities of Lumberyard, uh, what is it good at, and how can indie game developers who have primarily develop, developed using Unity, uh, how can they transition to using Lumberyard? Um, just capturing that experience and being able to create a vertical slice of a game. Not many people have used it before, not many games have come out before, so it's kind of paving a whole new path for students using this engine. Uh, and the past few weeks we've been getting up to date on the editor and how programming works in the engine, um, as well as creating a gold spike of simple Twitch integration, simple interactions, and character movement. I'm excited about this project because in this project we can try some new things we have never tried before. And in this week I think I learned a lot and I enjoy working in this team because I think everybody is so professional. and I can really learn a lot from everybody. Amazon has given us a lot of expectations, for example, like to test out the um, project, uh, to test out their game engine, to show off the graphics, and to develop like whatever that's like has not been developed from this pro from this game engine. So my work is um, basic, uh, is about to uh, design the interaction in the game and between the the game and Twitch. Uh, so I, in this week, I did some um, example UI to uh, import to the VR to test the whole pipeline of the uh, UI part. So for the last week, I uh, learned how to use the emotions in Lumberyard and import animations and models into the game engine. And then make brand trees to make the animations can transfer transfer into different, like, each other. These last couple of weeks, we've been meeting with our project advisors, Chris Klug and Jess Hammer. Uh, we've been meeting with our client liaison, who is Tom Corbett, and we've gotten a good sense of what we are supposed to be doing this semester. Of course, we had uh, last year's project, Sawmill, uh, which created a really engaging game as well. And we are going to be using that as a jumping off point for us to come up with our own ideas to pursue as the semester goes on.